And closer to home and just across the border from Hidalgo, thousands of migrants are camping out there on the streets of Reynosa. But we have learned they're about to be moved. Channel 5 Santiago Caicedo got an inside look at where they're headed. And it's all new at 10. Paying for the bathrooms and the These are the baseball fields just one mile west of the current migrant camp in Reynosa, where soon it will be home to nearly 2,000 people. Like right now as we speak, they could be building. They could be building the wall. They can be doing the bathrooms and the showers. But as you see, nothing's being built. Felicia Rangel Samponaro runs the sidewalk school and does not think this park is the safest option for the migrants. She complains the city hasn't started getting the place ready for people to live in. A Tamaulipa state official says the city will be in charge of moving migrants by bus to the new campsite. Since migrants began living in the park near the Hidalgo Bridge, a limited number of people would end up at the Senda de Vía migrant shelter to get a humanitarian parole to cross into the U.S. Now, migrants will be living on fields located next to an open-air landfill in a poor neighborhood in one of the most dangerous cities in the state, especially for migrants. Not only is the concern for safety of the migrants in this part of town, but also the area is full of trash and also there's animals grazing in many of the lots. We could have been doing this months ago. Everyone knew this was coming. Yeah. Felicia believes there is a lack of interest from the city and the Mexican federal government to prepare a place for migrants to stay in. Just a few blocks away, the sidewalk school will be renting part of a church's property in order to keep migrant families, children and black asylum seekers safe behind walls. The director of the sidewalk school tells us she tried to negotiate with the Autonomous University of Tamaulipas in Reynosa to try and use their gymnasium, just like the state used the same facility at the beginning of this year. But she says the university did not want to negotiate that option. So for now, the migrants will be going to that baseball field. We tried reaching out to the university and the city of Reynosa. We're still waiting to hear back. As soon as we have any answers, we'll let you know. At the Hidalgo Reynosa Bridge, Santiago Caicedo, Channel 5 News.